Yo, what's up everybody? Today I'm going to talk about jewelry photography. I have this beautiful piece of, of bracelet over here. How do we take a nice picture so we can capture uh, the essence of this? So today I'm going to photograph using this camera, which is a Nikon. Uh, it's actually a D40, it's an older Nikon. But this has a 50 50 mm lens right here. Okay. So, right here. 50 mm f1.4. It's a pretty shallow depth of field. It's a pretty good lens. So, I'm not looking for shallow depth of field. I am looking, however, to increase the depth of field, manage the lens, and take a sharp, clear picture, uh, diffuse the light, play around, experiment. So, let's see how that goes. Okay. So I don't have much of a studio set up, I just have my basement, I have, um, I have this closet uh, and I have stuff in it, I'm going to show it to you in a second. And it's just basically a white backdrop from a fabric store, okay? And then let's play around with it and, and see where to go. Yeah, a lot, a lot of stuff from, from the past. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up the backdrop. So now I have set up my studio and I'm going to go ahead and start taking some pictures. But I would like to mention that I'm going to be using a, a monolight strobe which is a high power flash which is external and it is connected to my camera wirelessly using a transmitter receiver. So let's take a look at that. So this is my monolight strobe or strobe light right here. Um, it is a Flashpoint 3320A. Okay, right here. It's got a bunch of things on it. This is the pilot lamp, and that is the strobe. Okay, so this is how I'm going to use it. So let me set up the strobe light, okay? So, right here, these are the wires. I'm going to go ahead and connect it. So, here's the transmitter. This communicates with that. Let's try this out, okay? 